Mike Hamilton, Lithia Toyota. Let's do a quick little tour of a 2022 Camry TRD V6 in Calvary Blue. This thing looks awesome in this color. Let me turn the camera around. I'll be right back. This is definitely the coolest Camry, in my opinion, with this color. It is, wow, this is really cool. So this blue, this Calvary blue, just really pops on this here. You got those TRD uh, wheels on here. Let me get out of my shadow with red brake calipers on here. Um, black mirror caps with tiny turn signal indicators. Um, they don't come with a sunroof on TRDs, but you get a black roof, so you get a two-tone paint job. Um, ground effects on this all the way around. Um, this is smart key with proximity. I don't have the key with me. Um, anyways, this is a TRD V6. Uh, so it's kind of a value line V6 because the uh, XSE V6s um, are more than this one here. But... 3.5 liter V6, 301 horsepower, 8 speed transmission, TRD tuned, front and rear suspension. Um, we got TRD package with JBL 1585, two tone, a midnight black metallic roof, uh, rear spoiler. Um, that's an extra $500 in mirror caps. Um, all weather floor liners, 259. Uh, after destination, you have a price of $35,829. Again, these XSEs, uh, I've seen them push 40,000 now. So I think this one is cooler than an XSE and less money. So coming to the back here, you got that big air diffuser there. We have uh, dual exhaust on this one here, big two exhaust. Um, we have, again, the air diffuser TRD badging in red here. That's always been that way with these TRDs and black badging overlays. And then the bigger spoiler is kind of covered up right now from the, the uh, protective plastic uh, that they put on here. Uh, but, and then also you got all these LED lights on this here. Venting and other things on here. Uh, again, ground effects are coming through here. And let's take a look on the uh, front of this here. So you got a uh, honeycomb grill, LED lights, all part of this one here. This is something I've never seen on a Toyota, so um, they want to warn you uh, high centering and coming off a driveway that you could scrape the front end because you do have those ground effects now sticking a little further out front. So you can get those skinned up. That was always a problem with the uh, older style Priuses at the old last generation. One of the things they do do on the, uh, on the TRD level of this vehicle, you get red seat belts on here. Um, so that's a pretty cool um, accessory add-on, uh, give it a little, uh, um, little character. Uh, you have uh, turn signal indicators. This also has backup camera with uh, rear cross traffic alerts, power windows, power mirrors, power locks. And then we have that red stitching on here to tie everything in. Uh, power uh, driver's seat here. I can remember if it's got power uh, passenger. I think it does not. I think this you, you're losing a power seat versus what the XSE would get on this. So you, it does have a jack system to make it go up and down, but this is a only a single power seat here. So you're going to get heated seats, but uh, no ventilated. Let me uh, look at the all soft touch desk and the red stitching in here. And um, I'm not even seeing the heated. I don't think this even has heated seats in it. So no heated seats on this one here. But you get the bigger, either 9 or 10 inch info infotainment on this one. TRD shifters on this one here. Again, soft hex leather part of this one. So, again, it misses a few things, but uh, this is Toyota's third fastest car. So you got uh, um, barely the RAV4 Prime is a little faster than this. I mean, like, literally like, like one tenth of one second in a zero to 60. So, um, virtually it's identical, um, but just take a look at this inside real quick and you can see everything in here. You got drive modes. This will have the paddle shifters, um, the four inch, uh, driver's information center, 
again that's yeah definitely the bigger 10 inch no digital uh, auto dimming rear view mirror when home link so that's another thing they're cutting back on uh, we do have the sos button it does have led lighting inside this now uh no light vanity mirror so there's another thing they're missing on so anyway so but you're still getting this straight sporty i don't know it does jbl premium audio you got the uh tweeters and a pillar so it's got the subwoofer and all those nice features too let me get pop the trunk don't make me pop the trunk now well let's take a look on the inside um there oh there it is so that's what i wanted to show you so it comes with all weather and floor mats but it also gets this trd embroidered red stitched out floor mats that that in in uh also cargo uh cover too along with the all weathers which these uh these ones look better because it definitely uh ties it all in better so a huge trunk on this one here giving you uh, a lot of uh, room plus it has pass through with the back seats oh there's your big subwoofer i was looking for too see it it's in the back there right behind there so they put the subwoofer right there so this is premium audio jbl clarify subwoofer big two sets of floor mats um, nice features here we got armrests with cup holders in the uh in this here well actually this does not have that so it's missing that on this one we got a protector seals on here apple carplay android auto xm radio all part of this here let's see, and then let's just give this one more a walk around here super clean super mean oh let me show you this here a lot of customers uh we would pull off this shrink wrap and stuff like that and it leaves like a line right here you can see the dust line and these cars have been coming in dirtier and dirtier because they're waiting for parts so they've been sitting in fields but sometimes the adhesive picks up a dirt line and it, and it sticks and then customers think there's a scratch on the car well that's happening because of how long they're sitting now in these fields and wherever they storm at before we get them looking for parts and then we pull those off and wash and sometimes that dirt sticks to that line and then makes it look like it, it like possibly has a scratch on it so something to think about if you're buying new to, to uh really check that because that's probably what's going on is this shrink wrap stuff is um being um being pulled up and then the the adhesive it leaves that line there and then it even when they wash it it still holds the dirt and uh, makes it look like there's a scratch or some of the adhesive itself that pulls up on the stuff but anyways again uh, thank you for watching let's back this out one more time take a look at this beauty um, i'm mike hamilton at lithia toyota we'll see you next time